you are listening to the voice of the holy gospel by wisdom ministries god bless you praise the lord hallelujah hail mary amen February 20th Tuesday A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Saint Matthew chapter 6 verses 7 to 15 When you are praying do not heap up empty phrases as the gentiles do for they think that they will be heard because of their many words do not be like them for your father knows what you need before you ask him pray then in this way our father in heaven hallowed be your name your kingdom come your will be done on earth as it is in heaven give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our debts as we also have forgiven our debtors and do not bring us to the time of trial but rescue us from the evil one for if you forgive others their trespasses your heavenly father will also forgive you but if you do not forgive others neither will your father forgive your trespasses the gospel of the lord my dear relatives in jesus christ we have an unlimited number of needs for which we constantly strive in the gospel reading of today jesus teaches us to pray the lord's prayer if we become aware of our prayers then we realize that uh, very often we pray for our earthly needs which are not able to give us lasting joy and peace we also have thirst for spiritual needs in our life but wants us to get fully immersed with the divine When we love God with whole heart we experience his guiding presence in our lives. The gospel reading gives us the revolutionary prayer in which Jesus asks us to call God as father. This prayer makes us unknown God to be intimately known. The transcendental God comes across to us as an immanent God. The prejudiced imaginary imagery of a punishing god gets shattered and in its place the loving and saving god is present this prayer is the invitation to do away with the external or pharisaic way of worshiping god in its place the lord's prayer gives the purpose of our earthly life as a glorification of the father by working for his kingdom and forgiving one another we need to reaffirm our relationship with our abba father by our way of life by our faithfulness to the word of god our actions become the fulfillment of god's word and a witness to other people so that our life will also be the radiating instrument of god's love we attain the purpose of our life and in the process radiate the love of god amen so
say, teach me to take. 